Hey, good evening. This is uh, Jared Adam Outdoors doing a review for fishhound.com, and tonight we're taking a look at the Intruder uh, by Bruiser Baits. Uh, the specific color we're looking at tonight is the uh, Blue Black Flake. It comes in an 8 count bag. And basically, I've already done a review of the Intruder uh, by Bruiser Baits before. I've done an action of Green Pumpkin. Immediately when you open up the uh, the bag, um, the first thing I'm sure everyone's going to see is the first thing I saw is that this bait is has a meticulous construction about it. I mean, if you look at there's absolutely no injection bolt seams on the side or anything. On the front, every one of the legs is nice and crisp and clean. There's no side pouring of the molding bleeding over. Uh, there's just a little bit in the back where it was clipped off. I mean, you got to have it somewhere, and probably that's where you're going to bring up your jig head. Uh, but real quick, doing this review for fishhound.com, you're down outdoors. If you guys haven't done it yet, check out fishhound.com. Uh, basically, you can get a free pack of these bruiser baits uh, if you sign up, I think, for their monthly membership or the annual. But check out fishhound.com if you need a reference. Um, use my name for the referral. But overall, uh, bruiser baits, I'm very, very happy with everything I've seen from bruiser baits so far. There's a little issue that I'll talk about later in the video, but. The Intruder and every other bait that I've gotten from them so far has been so well made. I mean, the meticulous process, the attention to the detail they put in these uh, really can't be beat. Uh, very, very strong. I mean, stretches out a lot, which is one big thing that I found is, you know, getting uh, any type of small fish biting on it and not getting a good hook set. I mean, I'm just going to pull it away. He's actually not going to rip off any appendages in my lures. Um, I think that the MSRP on these is like four or five bucks. Um, and for the eight count, uh, you really can't beat it. The one issue, the only issue I have ever seen so far from Bruiser Baits is, check out the bottom of the bag right there. Every one of these bags I've gotten from Bruiser Baits, and this is the third bag so far, um, has had that uh, spot where they either didn't uh, heat seal it properly or maybe um, dealing with uh, air, uh, air pressure and altitude changes. I mean, I've been in places, you know, above 15,000 feet where, you know, you get a bag of chips and it looks like, it looks like it's about to burst. Um, so that might be just one thing. I tried calling up Bruiser Baits specifically, and uh, no one at Bruiser Baits seems to answer a phone. Um, so they all go to voicemail. But I did contact the guys at Fishhound. And they're going to let Bruiser Baits know about that problem. And it's a, it's a systemic problem, but a small one. And it does not detract at all in the quality of the, uh, the soft floor, the soft bait that they, uh, that they make. I mean, you really can't beat it. Um, great looking appendages on here. And the attention to detail can't be beat. I've never seen this attention to detail complete in the entire bait uh, from any other manufacturer. So, well done, Bruiser Baits. Uh, really like it. So again, this is Jared Out Outdoors, you're your fishhound.com, and we're looking at the Bruiser Baits, the Intruder, and Blue Black Flake. Thank you very much. Have a good evening.